first half completely unacceptable. Completely unacceptable. Not good enough for, for us as a football club, not good enough for the supporters that were here, the supporters that were back home. Um, just unrecognisable really from the team that we've been this season. That, that's that's the most frustrating thing is that it just didn't look like us. We didn't start, we didn't show anything that we're good at, uh, that we've been had success with this season. That's that's the thing that really sort of disappoints me is that we you know we haven't shown a thing that we're good at in that first half. Uh, we've been second to everything. We haven't won headers, we haven't won tackles. Um, and that's a hallmark of this team. But, you know, I just said to him there, if they hadn't had blue and yellow on, I wouldn't realize, recognize that as, as my Wimbledon team. Um, normally, I could, I could put them in green and white stripes and you'd know it was us because of what we do well. Uh, in and out possession, we didn't do either of that, and we give we, we give them three goals um, of soft defending. So hard to take, and then you see a response. Obviously, we've had we've had some words at half time, and we needed to do something different and see a reaction. That's happened. That's happened. Fortunately, um, and it gives us something to. Um, something to take into the coming days and in, in going into Saturday at home because uh, we had to see a response. Um, and, and we've gone and we've gone and shown a lot of spirit in that second half. But obviously it's too late. It's too late. Game's gone. Well, game's gone. We get one. We're you know, we're up in the game. Send is off. Take the game away from us, really. Um, but ultimately, you know, we can talk about. We can talk about the sendings off if you want. I think Huss is, Huss is probably a red, but then by the same token, I think at the end of the first half, O'Hora on Davison is exactly the same foul, but, but Josh don't go down is the only difference. So has he got to go down to get to get the red card? Maybe, but shouldn't have to. Second one, I don't think there's any contact between PK and the lad, and he goes over and the referee sends him off. So makes it impossible with nine. Um, Hard enough with ten, let alone nine. But we actually showed a bit of resilience with, with nine and kept them out. And, you know, showed a lot of spirit in that second half. But we're, I wanted to see that from the off. Uh, it's, it's, it's too late. It's too late after 45. The game's gone. Sometimes you get away with a lack of 45 in football when you get in at nil nil or one nil. But at three nil, very very hard to come back into it. I think it's fair to say damage was done. Is there any positives you can take from this at all? Well, the second half and, and, and the spirit we showed um, is the positives. You know, JK's come on and he's, you know, he's put a shift in. He's up there on his own. It's difficult, but we, you know, got him on the pitch. We, obviously, he was, was perhaps looking to get Curtis on the pitch as well later on because of, you know, we knew we knew how long we could probably use him for. But then the second. Red card put pay to that, but what's the positive that with nine men we dug in, kept them out, and um, didn't go under. And it could have been a different scoreline at that stage, and you know, it wasn't. So that's the positive that, that the spirit we showed in the second half uh, that we're going to need going forward um, to undo like tonight's nights like tonight. We have to undo it, but. Once the dust settles here, we've lost the game of football, so we've got a chance to to win another game of football on Saturday. We've got a chance to play these again at, at our place. Uh, so chances to put it right, but like tonight, that hurts. That hurts. That hurts me. I hope it hurts uh, the boys, because um, I'm sure as well going to hurt the supporters and, uh, and made them well aware of that. What would your message be to the fans? Just thank, thanks for the support, obviously. You know, they clapped the boys off at the end and perhaps we didn't deserve, well we didn't deserve that, but the one positive out of the night is the support that they showed, how they got behind their football club. Um, thankfully, performances like that felt the first 45, uh, a few and far between this season, they're outliers and normally we bounce back as a team. Um, even in defeat, up till this point, you know, I've always felt like we've looked like us and you can lose a game of football and be a little bit unlucky or sometimes just don't go for you. Tonight, 
tonight that won us in that first half, and uh, we have to put that right, Sally.